What's up everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to be doing a little unboxing type of moment. So my boyfriend's stepmom gifted me this really cute, well it was really cute before I ruined it. Um, it was like really cute little ornaments and there was 12 of them for like the 12 days of Christmas my true love gave to me type of situation. And inside each and every little ornament there were mini little samples. Since I was so touched and surprised by this gift because it was literally mailed to my house like randomly and it was so sweet I decided to do a giveaway of my own so for Christmas I will be giving one of you lucky subscribers a gift card to Ulta Beauty for $200 now you can split this gift card with a friend or you can save all the $200 for yourself personally I would save all $200 for myself so don't even feel bad about it but I am giving away a $200 gift card to Ulta Beauty you just have to stick around to the end of the video to find out how to enter the giveaway Okay guys, so as I said, I got 12 little mini goodies and I'm going to quickly show you each and every one of them and then I'm going to show you how I created this look using each and every one of them. So first we have this mattifying face primer. We have a matte lipstick. We also have a Ulta Beauty highlighter. All of the products are Ulta Beauty brand, very on brand. Then we have a blush duo. So it's like a peachy toned and a more pink toned. Then we have two eyeshadows. One is a duo chrome and one is a duo matte. Very cute. Then we have two eye pencils or two eye crayons. One is to highlight your brow bone and one is more so in my opinion is like a very simplified way to cut your crease. Then we have a lip plumping oil. And then we have another pink little lip gloss. And then a classic little lipstick. A setting spray. So those are the 12 little goodies I got. And I did use all 12 of them to complete this look. So if you want to find out how I created this look, and more importantly, if you want to find out how you can win a $200 gift card to Ulta Beauty, then keep watching. Okay, so I already did the boring stuff off camera, like prep the lids and the eyebrows. So next would be eyes. I always start with my eyes. So we have four products that we can use to create an eyeshadow look. I think I'm just going to go ahead and dive in with the matte shadow first. If I can get it open. Um, into the dark brown shade. It looks like a really cute matte shade. And I'm going to grab my little mirror so I know what I'm doing. And I'm just going to apply this in the crease and it's actually a really really easy shadow to work with like it's it's blending out already I can already tell it's gonna be like really easy to work with so I am gonna do one eye on camera and the other eye off camera just to save us some time for the video I will it is a little chalky there are little patches that are not blending and I really honestly could not tell you why because I'm doing everything perfectly and I'm a beauty guru so this doesn't happen to somebody like me and then I'm going to grab a clean brush just like a random brush that's clean if I can find one and I'm going to dip into this pink nudish matte right here and then I'm just gonna like put that all over the lid and even bring it up some into the brown just to give it like a little natural transition I guess so now I'm going to grab the brow pencil and I'm going to highlight the brow and it's really creamy and really like that is pigmented this is cute I really like this I think I'm gonna put the crayon on next on the lid just in case it's not as pigmented as I want it to be, I can go over that and em emphasize it a little more with the um, the shimmer shades. Just need to get this open. So I'm just going to apply this in the center. That's actually really cute. One thing I will say about these like eyeshadow crayons is that if you're not really good at doing a cut crease, it like does the work for you. And it's not super like crazy. It's like a really natural, subtle eye moment right now, right here. So 
Next, I'm gonna grab this and a flat brush, and I'm going to go over the eye crayon with this, like this is like a dual, it's like a dual chrome. It's like pink and gold at the same time, which is really cute. And I'm gonna just go over in the inner corner, and that is so pigmented. Oh my gosh. And then on the back side of this flat brush, I'm gonna put the brown shade towards the outer V. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab the first brown shade and just like blend it into the outer corner just like that and that's like a quick little eye look like literally that was really quick so far so not horrible okay we gotta trust the process so i'm gonna go ahead and do the other eye pop on some lashes off camera and we'll move on to our next step okay so i paired it with like a really subtle natural lash moment like these are literally the most subtle lashes you'll ever see me wear ever in my life so we have used four of the 12 products to create this eye look. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to the rest of the face. So next we do have this matte. It says it's a matte face primer. It doesn't say anything about minimizing pores or anything like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and take his word for it. I'm going to go ahead and prime my face. And it looks like silicone. And trust me, I know what silicone looks like. Like I'm kind of afraid to put this on my face. It's like clear. All right, let me stop playing with it and just... All right, so our next step would be to do foundation and conceal. So I'm going to go ahead and do that quickly off camera and be right back. Okay, so I'm back. My face has been concealed, contoured, and baked. My next step would be to bronze. They There is no bronzer in this little mini gift set. So I'm going to go ahead and just bronze up myself. And then next would be... Blush, I don't necessarily use blush too often, but for the sake of the video and because I am genuinely curious as to how this is going to perform, I'm going to go ahead and try out this duo blush. So it is a light pink and a more peachy pink. So I'm just going to go ahead and dip into both. Ignore how my neck and chest don't match my face right now. We're focusing on the blush, okay? So I'm going to dip into the peachier one and I'm just going to smile and like... Oh, I look like I'm blushing. I'm just gonna actually like just dip into both of them and I'm just gonna go really hard with the blush like like that. That's pretty cute. I feel like it adds a lot more color. Um, I am getting like raccoon vibes though. I don't know if it's just like the viewfinder or what. But moving on, next we have highlighter and I'm gonna go ahead and apply some on the tip of my nose as I normally would. It's really cute and subtle. Nothing too crazy. And then the bridge of my nose. Like so, like that. And then, of course, on my cheekbones. I know a lot of people, like, in the beauty community have, have like, given up on, like, highlighter. Like, I know James Charles doesn't highlight his cheekbones anymore. And a couple other MUAs don't do it anymore. But I will never abandon highlighter, okay? I If I can accentuate my, you know, chiseled bone structure... You bet. Like, I haven't decided what lip combination I'm going to use. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the outline of my lips with the lipstick. It's really cute. And then I'm going to grab the... Actually, I can make a little, little bit bigger. Even better. Okay, so then I'm going to grab the matte liquid lipstick, and none of these have shades on them. So if you wanted to go out and get this, I don't know what to tell you. And then I'm going to put this in the middle. Ooh, I actually love this. This is such a cute combination. This makeup look is very much like subtle flex like you want to look good but you don't want you don't want to seem like you tried too hard because of the masks it makes it so sticky i never really wear lip gloss so i don't even really want to like bother with the lip gloss but since you know i'm the sake of the video i'm doing it for you guys so you better give it a thumbs up because i literally like don't bother with lip gloss anymore but it doesn't feel too heavy it just feels just right like really light really cute all right, and then last but not least, we have a makeup setting spray. It doesn't say matte. I made that up. 
Hopefully it comes out matte because I live for a good matte moment. Just gonna go ahead and dive in. It smells really good, actually. Wow, that was surprisingly, that was a good surprise. <laughs> All right, guys, so this is the final look, as you already saw in the intro, so I don't know why I had to say that. But, yeah, I really did enjoy this gift. It was very thoughtful. So, once again, thank you so much, Rachel. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. What's up, guys? Semi-attractive future me here to tell you how to enter the giveaway to win a $200 Ulta gift card. Number one, you must be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Number two, you must be following me on Instagram. Once you're on my Instagram, find the post where I announce the giveaway share it to your story and tag me that's number three and number four would be once you've completed all that comment down below in the comments done or a thumbs up sign so i know you've completed it all don't forget to tag me so i actually know you posted it on your story and that's how you can enter to win a 200 dollars gift card to ulta good luck also the winner of the giveaway will be announced here on my youtube channel on december 23rd i will be dropping a christmas special little glam look for you guys and at the end of the video I will announce the winner so stay tuned for that so good luck to everybody out there share 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 tag all your friends and I will catch you guys in the next video adios good luck